Hi there guys, ever wanted to paint a miniature on your computer and you didn't know how? Let's do this with just one model from the internet, either painted or unpainted, and the other tank tool, GIMP, and all for free. Hi there, ever wanted to paint a miniature on your computer and you don't know how to? We can do this for free, just using a model from the internet, either painted or unpainted, and the editing tool GIMP. Let's check it out. Try to find a good quality model, um, especially with a white background. So what I recommend is that you go to the Games Workshop um, website or the website from your model. Um, they have nice quality pictures. You could get just uh, the whole unit, but I'm going to look at this guy. So I can copy the image, I paste it in GIMP, then I want to go to a layer and I create a new layer out of it and I choose color HSL instead of emote, instead of normal, normally it's up here, normal, we this time want color HSL and accept. This will create a new layer and it will allow us to paint over a model without being able to paint on the background. See, here I'm not painting in the background. So we get a nice color that we want. Let's get some nice dark red or bright red. I have my opacity at 50%. Um, the higher the opacity, the brighter the color and the stronger the color is. So you can see that with a 50% opacity, the first layer will be kind of orange. You can apply a second layer and it will become a little bit stronger. And with the third layer, we can see it's stronger. If I set the opacity to 100, it will be the strongest color. So just for comparison, I will just paint here the foot. And you can see it's almost the same color or at least as strong as three layers of the 50%. Um, as you can see, I'm trying to paint outside and it's not working. So this is really good. Um, I will go back to 50%. I will set here a little trace of blood some bloody X and then um, I will get some dark color some kind of gray and I will paint some gray here there is a slight modification of the color depending on the background see here with the yellow I get some kind of brown or grayish brown um, however if I would paint this area that's already black um, I'm not getting that much of a difference it's getting kind of stained if you see but the color here and here doesn't really look exactly the same so you have to take a little bit that into account when you want to change things um, but basically that works really well um, I will also make some kind of mark here this orc has been kinda marked with the blue color and up to here um, if I don't like it I can go one more layer I find it amazing um, so that's it guys I think you can go on and on and create your most detailed awesome paintings digitally here on GIMP. Um, so basically this is free. I hope you liked this video. If you liked it, consider subscribing and supporting me with my Patreon that you can find in the description. See you next time and thank you for watching.